Hello everyone. Hi, Miss Varda here. Hope you're all well and that you're keeping safe and staying fit and healthy. Um, so today I'm going to be talking about staying fit. Um, hopefully you've all been taking up your quota of one hour outdoors to have a nice walk or a jog. Um, and of course, staying fit and healthy at home as well, whether it's Mr. Lombard's Keep Fit videos, Joe Wicks, although it is a little bit hard, even though it's meant for children. Um, and it's important, isn't it, to stay fit? Because if you imagine the amount of exercise that you take part in at school, whether it's walking from lesson to lesson, your P lessons, um, when you have your breaks and lunch, uh, not to mention all those extracurricular activities you get involved in that are now um, not able to conduct. So it's really important you don't lose that. So 5k, jog, walk, run, whatever you may want it to be. So my first one, I didn't actually take uh, any advice from anyone and just ran it. And quite frankly, I felt like my lungs were on fire and my head was going to explode. That was not a good strategy to do a first run. However, week after week, as I built up my stamina, I decided um, to take part in half a marathon. And this time I thought I need to take expert advice and undertook a 16 week training program, um, which was hard, but incredibly, when you follow a plan from an expert and build up um, using that plan, it, it comes together. And soon enough, you're like, wow, how did that happen? But it happens because you're doing what's required of you, week on, week out, and it is slowly building you up to that final event of the half marathon. Um, this was my medal, the Hackney Half, and that was two years ago. So if I can do it um, without stopping, following a plan, Okay, it took me a long time, um, over two and a half hours, but I'm sure you can. And actually this year, um, my colleagues and I were due to run the half marathon together. Yesterday, my family and I um, collectively ran four mini marathons. Uh, by running around the garden 26 times each. Enjoy. So running, why do I do it? Why do I enjoy it? Um, I find it's a good way to forget about things at times and switch off and listen to music or switch off and listen to a book. And other times, if there's something really uh, playing on your mind, it gives you the time and the space without distractions to really think it through. Um, and I love that about running. Whatever your need is, it, it's there for you. Switch off, problem solve. It's a great experience. Now, of course, when you're running, you're also getting fitter. So why not give it a go with your first 5K following a training plan um, and then build up to a 10K, then a half a marathon. Take care, stay fit, and I hope to see you soon.